Hello, my name is Beth Dixon, and this is a video series based on Vicki Borlaug's PowerPoint presentation on binomial distribution. I wish to thank Mrs. Borlaug for allowing me to use her PowerPoint to make this set of videos on this PowerPoint, and this in this PowerPoint, we cover the concept of binomials and practice some examples on binomial distributions. And we are in the middle of a problem on uh, binomials and setting up a probability and construction of a probability distribution. And this is a second technique in doing so. Let's reread the problem to refresh our mind. The probability that a child will like a new flavored toothpaste is 0 0.80. Three children are randomly selected. Construct a probability distribution for the number of children in this group that like the new flavored toothpaste. I will remind you of our variables that we discovered in example in video one. And we have our chart that we're attempting to fill in. In this case, we're going to build a tree diagram to help us use and create our different probabilities to figure out our probabilities for our tables. The first child is chosen can either like or not like the toothpaste. The second child is then chosen and that child will either like or not like, like or not like, the toothpaste and follow the first child. The third child then has the same option of liking or not liking and it follows any of the four that we got with the second. So we now have our tree diagram. And we have a total of eight possibilities. These possibilities are not equally likely, but we can list the different outcomes and their individual probabilities. The first one would be that we got a child that liked, then a child that liked, and then a child that liked the toothpaste. then liked, liked, not liked, and I'm not going to read through these, but I will click through the screen. And you can pause the video and watch those. Again, for the like, 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 what are the possibilities or probabilities, excuse me, for those? Well, that would be 0 0.8 times 0 0.8 times 0 0.8 because the probability of liking the toothpaste is 0 0.8. And that gives us 0 0.512. For the next one down, we have two likes followed by a not like. So that would be 0 0.8 times 0 0.8 times 0 0.2 and gives us 0 0.128. And I'm not going to read in the rest of these numbers. I think it would be better and less confusing instead of me trying to read all those numbers out loud for you to stop and read those and make sure you understand where all those numbers are coming from.
Now, the first X that we have is that none of the children like the toothpaste. And we have that one highlighted for us, so that probability is one of those, which is 1 times 0 0.008, which gives us 0 0.008. We have that one of the children like the toothpaste, so we're looking for one L in our prob in our setups here, and that would be these three that are highlighted, and all of those probabilities are the same at 0 0.032, and since there are three of those, we can just multiply three times 0 0.032 to get 0 0.0. 096. Then we're to looking for two L's and there are the three with two L's so that would be three times 0 0.128 because all of their probabilities are the same and we get 0 0.384. And next we get three likes, one way to do that and one times 0 0.512, which is 0 0.512. Notice again that it's the count multiplied by the same probability, the count and the probability. I'm again going to pause here to keep these videos a little bit shorter, and we will pick up with Technique 3 in the next video.